Hey guys, it's Joe and welcome back. So every day since surgery, I have been trying to do something active. The first day that meant like getting out of bed once. Um, the second day that meant maybe walking around on crutches for like two minutes. And so I've been building up slowly, but since I came home and I've got the nerve block out about three days ago, I have been trying to be a little bit more active and more active right now means doing um, you know, a very, very quick, brief strengthening routine once or twice a day and spending the rest of the day primarily on the couch with my leg elevated because I'm still in a lot of pain. But I do want to stay active. I do want to stay um, as healthy as I can during this time and keep building up those muscles that are going to be necessary when I start working with the prosthetic. And so I want to take you through what I've been doing once or twice a day. It's really simple. Some of the exercises were shown to me in physical therapy at the hospital, but don't do any of these without clearing them with a doctor. Um, this is just what I've been doing personally. And um, let me show you what I've been working through. So the first thing I try to work on every day is um, hip motion and, and strength. So I'll do external uh, lifts basically, which is lifting my leg out five times like this, uh, holding onto my crutches, uh, whatever way seems stable, and then lifting my leg backwards to work on those um, back muscles as well. Five times there. And then I will also swing my leg forward five times. I know five is a small number, but hey, I'm still working up to it. And then after that, I will rotate all the way around five times each way. As you can see, I'm kind of still working on my balance there. Uh, it's really important that you uh, are safe with this, so make sure that you are near things you can grab. Um, I feel kind of comfortable with my balance right now, um, so I'm just holding on my crutches, but make sure you're doing this safely if you do do it. Next one is I've been doing push-ups every day um, just to kind of keep other parts of my body strong as well, so I'll do five push-ups here. And then at the end of it, uh, making sure I'm keeping my limb off the ground, my residual limb off the ground. And then at the end of it, I will stretch up. Again, this was something that the doctor said was okay to do um, to kind of reverse all the laying down that I have been doing. After that, um, I've been doing core exercises. This is a uh, fairly sloppy version of V-ups, but at least it gets me some core work in. So kind of reaching up and touching my shins five times as well. And then last but not least, I have been doing one-legged squats off the couch, holding onto my crutch to continue to strengthen that good leg. But I've been doing that really carefully so I don't hurt anything because um, that's the one good leg I've got left. So that's what I've been doing, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you do everything safely. Everyone moves at their own pace. I know some people were way ahead of me at this point, and some people aren't going to be able to get out of bed at this point. And so it's really important that you listen to your body and your doctors and take things at your pace. Take care of yourselves, whatever that means for you, and best of luck in your recovery. Thanks, guys. I'll talk to you soon.